Hello. Uh, yes. Um, I uh, I uh, developed a handwritten text recognition model for uh, Nepalese manuscripts written in the Pratchalot script, uh, like uh, those that you can see here um, on the um, on the folio um, that I uh, screenshotted here. And uh, this model that I developed uh, as part of an, an AHRC funded project uh, at SOAS University of London um, uh, essentially is, is made to recognize Pratchelet and uh, transcribe it into Pratchelet Unicode. And um, one, of the, one of the main difficulties I had uh, in creating this model was essentially baselines uh, or layout recognition. As you can see here in this picture, uh, this is th these are the results that I got using um, using um, I think it was using the Tibetan Pecha um, layout uh, recognition model. I got pretty good results with universal lines, but it also requires a lot of manual correction. Um, there are a lot of other issues. One of them is that um, there are very few manuscripts either in Sanskrit or Newar, and those are the two languages uh, which the manuscripts that I was working with uh, were in. There, there were very few um, uh, fully diplomatic uh, additions to work with. Um, so I had to, uh, essentially, I, I bootstrapped uh, Sanskrit editions of uh, some, San uh, some Sanskrit texts, which had, um, which had um, versions in a manuscript form, and that sped up the process considerably. And so using about four different manuscripts, um, uh, two, in, uh, two of them in Newar, and two of them in Sanskrit, I was able to, in 20, training, training the model in 2022, I was able to get a character error rate of 2.6. And um, then essentially um, uh, correcting, uh, correcting uh, new transcriptions and then refeeding them into the model, I was able to get a character error rate of 2.0. I also deposited my data on in the Heidelberg uh, University system, um, the Hey Data uh, system, and um, and uh, yeah, th th this is this is really part of a bigger project uh, that uh, I'm involved with, uh, whose goal is essentially to create a, a corpus of Newar, and since there are so few. Um, existing transcriptions of Newar manuscripts uh, or texts at all out there, um, whether diplomatic or edited. Um, this is really one of the first steps in our pipeline. And so it, it was really, uh, really essential. And it's it's something that I, I'm still working on. Um, so uh, yeah, and I think that is about all that I'll say for now. Thank you.